On February 6, 1991, a pair of A-10 Warthogs struck two Iraqi tanks in Kuwait when one of the pilots detected unusual activity not far from their location. He made the decision to closely observe it by conducting an aerial survey at an altitude of 6,000 feet. Two Iraqi helicopters were observed in flight at that location. The Iraqis also detected the A-10, split up, and initiated evasive measures. The American pilot speedily set up his GAU-8 cannon, followed by the launch of an AIM-9. However, the missile experienced issues due to the high temperature of the desert sand. Afterwards, he fired 75 shots, none of which successfully made contact with the chopper. The pilot attempted another maneuver and fired a total of 100 rounds, but once again failed to hit the target. He proceeded to refocus his aim, firing a further 100 shots, though unfortunately failing to hit the target once more. After wasting around 275 rounds, the pilot fired an additional 100 rounds. This time, the pilot had success in targeting the helicopter, resulting in a detonation akin to a bomb impact. 